hello and welcome welcome to yet another video tutorial in today's tutorial we are going to learn about ui tech field delegates so if you are aware of delegate then that's a very good thing and if you're not then let me tell you that delegates are the objects that perform certain things for other objects or in other way you can say delegates are the object that notifies the other objects when something happens to them for example in ui text field there are there is a delegate that tells text field did begin editing as its name says that text field did begin editing so as soon as user taps on test text field this delegates method get fired so so the event is whenever that begins to edit so whenever user taps it suppose that it's going to edit that field and it notifies the delegate so let's see run about open up xcode create a new xcode project single view app and we say UI text field delegate tutorial next and we will save it on a hard drive this is uh, the source cards and this is block tutorials new folder and UI text field delegates and I will save it great so this is a uh, export template for single view app and here in view controller.com we are going to create uh, a trade IB outlet we create txt name we will give it to our text field ui text field and in our main dot storyboard we will drag a ui text field ui here it is uh, first change the color it is gone and here we will add our text field we will give it a constraints and have 25 20 20 and the height will be say 40 and here our text field and also we will here what we have to do first we have text name dot delegate is equals to self this line tells that the text field the delegates for the text field txt name should be written in view controller dot view controller dot shift file that whenever the delegate related to ui text field txt name gets called the that method will be implemented in view controller and the compiler should look at this view controller for that we have also tell this that this is confirming to ui text field delegate we have certain delegates i already wrote it here and we will write it here so that we can clearly look what are these here i ordered this like this text field should begin editing so let's run this app and see what happens maybe something happens to the x code mm, open it and here it is let's run the code now so 
So here you can see the app runs successfully on our iPhone 10 simulator and it's crashed because we didn't connect our IV outlet to our storyboard and it says execute bad instruction. So this is the bad instruction. And here we connect. And so here you can see in our console, I already print that the whenever this one of these delegate called and this line will be printed. So let's say I tap on it here, and you can see first get called text field should begin editing so as soon as user taps on a text field it begins editing and you will get notified in this delegate that the text field should begin editing and then text become first responder so after this this method of delegate is called that this tells you that the text field did begin editing in the first is called text field should begin editing this ask the delegate if editing should begin in the specifier if I done false here then it will not start editing let's see what happens whenever text will become first responder the text field did begin editing method called as you see in our console let's clear the console and I tap and it says text field should begin editing only call because I turned false so it didn't allow user to type I already text field should begin editing so for it should be true in order to let text field should begin text should text field did begin editing to work that And here you can see now I turn true in text field should begin editing means that lower text field to edit and here you can see cursor and here text field did become first responder. So now one more method is here. This is very important that should change character in range. It gets called whenever you or user types in a text field. It should change character is getting called. Let's see again if I delete the characters is told because the characters get changed in the text field. So these are the three most important delegates and also here the text field should return. It gets called whenever a keyboard is not here and keyboard return key is gets called. This is text field should return. Whenever this return key key is pressed, the text field should return card. So so we learn should begin editing, did begin editing text field should change character in range and text field should return so now these are the delegate methods so you know how when and when they called you see the live example and here one is text field did edit and editing and text field should edit editing and this is same to text field should begin editing if I return false then it will not end editing and it's still remains active and uh, text for did editing gets called whenever it resigned first responder or it end editing so let's see for this we will add ui button on top and we will name it done and here we will action done with text field and here we will call self dot view and editing so this will and editing for all text fields and here we will pass true so now let's run the code again and now you will see 
the text field should edit end editing and text field did end editing gets called and here let's say uh, tap on here and you can say text field should begin editing text become first responder i tap it say should change character and when i press return it say text field should return and when i press done let's uh, delete it and then press done it says text field should end editing and text field did end editing so now our own method one method means that text field should clear each text field has a button clear so here it's a property the clear button is never appears I say appears while editing and I run the code again so whenever this clear button gets called just delegate will get notified that text field should clear so here I tell now you can see here the this button so it gets whenever it gets called the text field should clear method is gets called so here you can see text will gets clear and text field should clear methods called so here in this video you learn about UI text field delegate method if you have any question then please feel free to comment this is a very short video and hope you learn something about UI text field delegates and if you like our video then please do like our video and share our video and do subscribe to our channel so that you can get future updates or our video release we are going to cover whole tutorials of ios development in swift 4 and we will try to cover it like we are creating our videos for someone who is a beginner who doesn't know very much about ios app learns through our video so this is a very simple video of ui text field delegate and hope you enjoyed it thanks for watching bye for now and do subscribe thanks